Hello everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install SAM server on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 PC or laptop here. So the, if you have Windows 11, process is the same here. So first of all, you need to go to any browser here and search for SAM download here. After searching for the SAM download, you will see a website here which is called www.apachefriends.org download here, which is the SAM official server here. So just click on download SAM here. After that, you will find the latest version of the XAMPP here, which is 8.0, 8.1, and 8.2. These are version for 64-bit, and this is also for 64-bit. And if you go down, you will find XAMPP for Linux here, and XAMPP for OS X here. So we're going to download for the Windows here. If you don't know if your Windows is 64-bit or not, just go to the this PC option here, right-click on it, go to Properties. After opening the property here, you will see option called system type here. And as you can see, my PC is 64-bit operating system. So we're going to download the 64-bit operator here. So just click on download here. And it will take you to uh, another page here. But your XAMPP file is downloading for preparing for downloading here. And after a few moments, as you can see, XAMPP exe file is downloading here in the left corner, as you can see. And it is only 143 MB here. Now after completing the download here, you just need to run the program here. So just click on it and click open here. As you can see here is the Zam setup wizard here. So you just have to click next here. Now keep all the settings default here. So just click next here. And your Zam will be and your Zam file will be installed in the C folder here as you can see. So just click next. Now keep the language English here. So just click next here. And setup is ready now and it will be begun to install in. So just click next. And as you can see, uh, your XAMPP server is installing here, so it's going to take some time here. And as you can see, our XAMPP server is completely installed. And if you want to start the control panel now, just check but check button here, as you can see. So just click finish here, and it will start the control panel here. So let's see if it's properly working or not. Now as you can see, our XAMPP server is starting here, so it's properly working here. So if I just click on Apache here and just start the apache server here and as you can see it's status change and also you have to allow access to the apache HTTP server here so just click allow access and as you can see status change detected running and apache is running here so if you want to know this server is working or not so just go to any browser here go to a new tab and search for local host here local host press enter as you can see, here is the XAMPP dashboard here. So that means your control panel and the XAMPP server is working here. So that's it, guys. This is how you download and install the XAMPP server in Windows 10 or Windows 11 here. So if you found this video helpful, please subscribe to this channel. And thank you for watching.